Hey everyone, Zero Jitty here with the XBLA Fans channel here. You kick taste of Rusty Gun, a platforming shooter game which the story is essentially aliens invade and you're going to kill them. Uh, so far, this has been pretty generic. Uh, the levels have been fairly long and uh, kind of easy, but yeah, other than that, it's got nothing super special. Uh, I've beaten a big old chunk of it so far. Uh, fair warning for achievement hunters, uh, you have to at least get up to the... Uh, fourth boss uh if you want to have a even uh, quote unquote even gamer score there are achievements that ends with like ones and stuff like that in this game but uh let's go uh by the way uh cliche snow level but uh anyways this is me i can jump i can shoot uh i have different uh sort of uh shots that i've unlocked from bosses and i've unlocked the uh slide ability which uh uh, reminds me of Mega Man, and that makes me happy, at least. Uh, as you can see in the top left, I got my health. In the upper right, I have my beer bottles, because that's clearly what that is. Uh, it says after you collect 100 of those, you get a heart or something like that. I've never seen it actually do that. Maybe you need to collect 100 without dying, or maybe uh, it's something else. But that bottle never... Uh, I haven't seen that bottle fill all the way up. It seems to get about to where it is now and then just stops. There's also always that zero on it. Also, the bottles fly to the left screen and uh, kind of act like they're just kind of looping around to the right off screen. Let's go and grab these. Yeah, they're just kind of going off to the left for some reason. But anyways, uh, the very the exact layout of this game is uh, two levels, a third level, and that third level has a boss. I don't trust that little snow mound. All right, let's keep going. Uh, the of course at some point we I had a sewer level which was incredibly easy actually I didn't take any damage in it at all because uh, the way it was sort of uh, laid out you were um, you were uh, going up and down ladders so you were actually coming up under enemies this game has a tendency to throw enemies at you from the right side like the moment they see you uh, they start sh like trying to attack you and they get you once in a while. I don't know how I could have made that jump. I wonder if I can jump on that little uh, circle thing. Like I said before, like, see there, the bottle just blinked. I don't know what that, I don't have no idea what's happening with that bottle. Can I, oh, okay. That was not uh, really spelled out too well. Uh, they actually had a tutorial on having to uh, jump on a button to make it work. It's interesting that I did not get a tutorial for uh, jumping on that uh, snow pile. Uh, there was a uh, level I was riding in my car, just shooting up for uh, like the different directions. Uh, there was this, sort of the same thing when I was on a skateboard. That was a seagull. I didn't even realize that until now. Yeah, secret. You're collecting calendars. They have uh, pretty girls on them. Again, I don't understand this bottle mechanic. And I'm not sure that the game understands it either. That or it's just broken. I don't feel comfortable killing penguins though. So far most of the animals I've killed uh, aren't aliens. Uh, there's zombies. Uh, I swear I hit the A button there. There's the polar bears, there's the penguins. Ooh, look, an achievement. Oh, no country for old men. Mm. But yeah, uh, a lot of killing non-alien creatures. Oh, the bottle thing has actually gone up. Mm. And I, I know that I've collected more than 100 of those bottles. I don't know if it means I get an extra, like, heart uh, container. Oh, um, a heart thing. Or it just re recovers a uh, heart. Let's go ahead and just get these. Like one of the achievements is like doing this uh, like 44 times, which is weird. Get out of here, seagull. You don't you don't exist in this climate, especially in Antarctica. Nothing exists in that climate. We. Uh, so far, the bosses have been ridiculously easy. I've actually beaten most of them without taking hits. Because they, they literally have th maybe one to three attacks, and that's it. Or three attacks, and that's it. 
happens if I... Okay. That's a dangerous bullet. Oh yeah, like the alien, the eyeball is the most alien thing. Uh oh. Got him. Also, the gun doesn't sound good. I wonder if uh, quitting and restarting this game fixed the bottle thing. Oh, the penguin sounds cute. We're not going to kill that one. He gets to survive. Did we kill him? Oh, nope, here he comes. So that polar bear has the exact same attack as another zombie who would just throw a bone at me. That snowman had a laser gun. If the uh, bo the bottles are just giving you uh, an extra health bit back, I think that's unneeded because most of these levels you don't need that much health to complete. And you also get this checkpoint, which kind of makes them irrelevant. I say that as I uh, die. I forgot that those fell and I panicked a bit. We've all done it. But yeah, this, this game's really just nothing too special to write home about. Other than that, like uh, you could see how you see how close I am to the end of the game. I'm Sure, at some point I'll fight the final boss, be a hero, and return to whatever life I had. Uh, earlier, a lot of the enemies were making kind of uh, like spitting and like burping sounds because I don't know. I'm waiting for that seagull to come back because I know he is. Oh, that's the end of the level. I don't know what that sound was, but okay. So the, this level is going to be uh, longer. And, uh, uh, that's about it. And it'll have the boss in it. The normal levels aren't that bad. It's just the final level for the boss is just a little bit, uh, gets you a little wary. A lot of ladders in this Antarctic, uh, desert scape. I had once had a very long argument with a person that, uh, there does not need to be sand for it to be called a desert. Oh, also you can't jump off of ladders. Which I guess maybe that's safety. I don't know. I don't know. I was going to make a joke about like OSHA, but it would probably be terrible. There's a lot of seagulls. Lots of seagulls. It's also a weird sound for that uh bounce pad. Yeah, whatever. So there's usually uh for these uh the last third levels the uh a, a uh, checkpoint and then another checkpoint right for the boss. This is actually the most I have died in a uh, three level set. Uh oh, hold on. I don't know where you get where they're getting that those fish from. All right, this should be the boss right here. Also, you uh, can only do one da bit of damage at a time. Oh, he's a Duke Hadoukening me. Oh, snowball. Oh boy. Okay, this is not a good boss. Oh gosh. But yeah, like, like this is why I think the levels take too long. You do so little damage to the boss and the invulnerability on the boss is, is stupid. Just, I'm just spamming the fire button. We should be done with this soon. Oh, he got me. 
Did you see? Uh, that was was that vertical uh, vertical screen tearing I just saw. That's crazy. I've never seen that before. Yeah, we're fine. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, come on. Got him. Ooh, boat. I'll show the boat level. Blowed up three times. Blowed up. I don't think it's a word. It'd be blew up three times, wouldn't it? But you, you get the idea. That's... That's Rusty Gun. I am Zero JD. This is the XBLA Fans channel. Thank you very much for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.